Gonzalez here with Entertainment Weekly and EW.com broadcasting live from Comic-Con and I'm here with some of the new cast members of the latest Twilight movie. Hey guys, introduce Hi. yourselves. Corey Weinberg. Uh, Noel Fisher. Now you all are part of one of the new covens, but tell me a little bit about that and about what your roles are in this last film. Well, we're the Romanian covens and um, we used to rule the vampire world and we're 3,000 years old. And uh, the Volturi ambushed us, killed our, all our coven, our families, our wives. And we've been looking to have revenge for 1,500 years. And now that they're coming after the Collins, we decided this is the perfect time to do it. We're basically like the ultimate grudge holders. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice. <laughs> Grudges are always great. And they make for great films, especially yeah. here at Comic-Con. Now, you all are Comic-Con virgins, I hear. Yes. First timers. First time. First time. Are you ready for the madness of joining sort of the Twilight ethos? I don't know what to be ready for. That's the problem. <laughs> I mean, how do, you, how do you get ready for something you don't know anything about? Yeah. You know? yeah. 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 So you're just, I mean, my suggestion to you would be, like, take some armor to the okay. panels in case you're mobbed. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. What, I mean... Where would we buy armor? Just it's Comic-Con. Comic you can buy armor anywhere. That's a good point. I bet a lot of people have yeah. some armor. <laughs> but you told me before this you, that you were going to dress up next year if you came. Yes. Yes. I'm, I'm trying what probably you catnip. You know, yeah. or catnip. Or catnip. Or catnip. <laughs> <laughs> whatever, whatever her name is. She's not in Twilight, so I don't care. And you're selling this... Well, and you're selling this, and we're not from either one. We're from Twilight, so this is not right, so we're just going to move it. Now, what would you dress up as if you were coming to Comic-Con in a costume? Um, we well, know you're Katniss, bow and arrow. I yes. I, li I, liked, I liked your idea of kind of coming as someone really tall, just because it would be funny. Chewbacca, something like that, maybe. You know, I could do something. I could do something. As long as it was a very tall character, so people would be like, wait, that Chewbacca's like 5'7". <laughs> What's happening? I'm five feet tall. We should come as like matching Chewbacca next year. Oh, yeah, it's great. Although I, I need to work on like my sound, like my. You have a. Let's hear the growl. I, yeah. I couldn't. Ooh. Hey. <laughs> that was pretty good. That's not bad at that all. That was pretty good. I practice at home. <laughs> I practice a lot. Tell people what they can expect from the last film in like a nice little uh, capsule here. Um, the, you mean the last film, I think, I think uh, they can expect to be blown away. I think it's going to be uh, the definition of epic. A few surprises. Yeah, um, um, I think that the, this this part of the book is really cool, and, and the movie I think uh, will do this very well. It expands Stephanie Meyer's world in a really great way. You see all these new people, all these really uh, uh, kind of all, a lot of the politics of the vampire world come to light in this, and I think that that's going to be uh, really interesting to see. I hear there's a big confrontation at the end. A big. That's where one of the surprises is going to be, and mm -hmm. you know, that's one of the things that we can't really talk about. But I think, <laughs> you know, even people that are not fans of Twilight, I think are going to enjoy this one.